how you doing? Hey, in a little while, to, to the big people, I'm going to be sharing the story of Jonah. And, um, well, I'll explain, I'll explain that to the big people later. But the story of Jonah is a wonderful story. Jonah gets a calling from God to go to Nineveh. But instead of going to Nineveh, he goes to a place called Tarshish. Now, God doesn't, Jonah doesn't want to do what God wants him to do. And sometimes, you know, that, that can happen in our lives. Do you know where New York is? You ever been to New York City? No? Okay, well, New York City in our country is here. And on the other side, you ever hear, ever hear of a place called Los Angeles in California? Okay, L.A. is over here. And, and Nineveh in the Bible, in the Bible times, it was like New York and L.A. Nineveh was here, and Tarshish was like way over here. And so Jonah, so Jonah, what do I have a picture of here? What is that? It's a boat. Jonah got in a boat to go as far away as he could. He went to Tarshish instead of Nineveh. But like he went, I'm going to L.A., I'm not going to New York. And when he was on the boat, yes, you see the boat? It was just like this, just like that boat. And he got on that boat. And when he was on the boat, there was a really bad storm. And everybody figured out that the storm happened because that Jonah was, was running away from where God wanted him to go. So Jonah even said to all the sailors, he said, I want you to, they said, no, we can't throw you overboard. Jonah said, it'll save everybody else. So he jumped off the ship and something really exciting happened. What's this a picture of? A whale. And the Bible tells us that a whale swallowed Jonah up. And Jonah was able to live inside of the whale for like three days. And then God kind of came back to him and said, maybe you really ought to go to Nineveh instead of Tarshish. And Jonah prayed to God, and Jonah and God got together again. And the, the big fish spit Jonah out on the sea. And Jonah went, went to Nineveh and told the people in Nineveh, they're called Ninevites, he told them all about God. And exciting things happened. The people ended up believing in God. Now what's this a picture of? It's a picture of the cross. Amen. And Jesus in his ministry even talked about Jonah and talked about the wonderful thing that happened. That he was inside the fish for three days but that God brought him out. And that God would do the same thing for Jesus when he died on the cross for our sins. Jonah is a very exciting story. It's like even people who don't know the Bible, they know the story of Jonah. It's kind of like David and Goliath. But we're so thankful that God doesn't give up on Jonah. That God gives Jonah a second chance. And that Jonah ends up being used by God. To, to tell the wonderful news about God to the Ninevites. Let's pray together. Lord Jesus, we love you. We need you, Jesus. And just have your hand upon us. Bless us that we may be a blessing in your kingdom. Especially be with Dutch, Morley, Lord, and upon all our children. Bless us, Lord. Bless them and uh, be with us. In your name we pray and all God's people say. Amen. 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 Thank you. Next for coming.